Hi guys, welcome to Ogles Group. Nice car for you here today. Took this in part exchange recently from a nice couple from Surrey. Bought a white Range Rover from us. And this is a March 2010 10 registered. Audi 3 litre TDI Quattro S-Line um, uh, Auto uh, convertible, obviously. Um, in, in finished in Monza Silver, arguably, I think, one of the best colours for this car. Uh, we just sent the alloys away to be professionally and fully refurbished in uh, shadow chrome. We do most of our cars like that, and I just think uh, just think it sets the motor car off, and I hope you agree with that. Done 90,000 miles, uh, got nine services, so a robust history, um, recently serviced. It's had a handbrake module, it's had a couple of new tyres, and it's in good order given the price point of this motor car. And it's 11 years old now, but doesn't look it. And, and you know, in my world, I think this is one of the best four-seater convertibles you can buy. It's three-liter TDI with a proper four-wheel drive system and auto, and doesn't go wrong very often. But uh, purpose of the video is to go around the car in detail, tell you a bit more about it, though, because as we go. So coming onto the front bumper, open, got rear park sensing, guys. Standard headlamps here. Obviously, a little bit weathered. Look, guys, it's 11 years old, 90,000 miles. Okay, so it's not new car. It's not new car money. Expect the odd stone chip um, and paint blemish here and there, but it's nothing major but to be expected on a used car, okay? Leading edge of the bonnet, clean and tidy. Couple of little marks here, guys, yeah. I'm not gonna get involved, given the price point. There's a little ouch down there, okay? But the rest of the bonnet looks to be in good order to us. Bosch wipers, always nice to see. Windscreen, got some light chip into it. Black power hood, we've got two keys for it. And I just, as I said earlier, I think Monza Silver is one of the best colours for A5. And you just wouldn't think that car's 11 years old now, would you? Just crying out to be on a private number. Up onto his front wing, on the passenger side. That looks to be in good order. Sorry about the wind noise in the background if you're picking that up. Right, these alloys, guys. We've sent this away to be professionally uh, refurbished, acid dipped, stripped, powder coated, and they've come back in shadow chrome. They're the original Audi alloys. And you've got a recently new tyre on there. I think all the tyres are good on this car at around... Um, six seven mil as i said read the reviews on these guys but for my money these are 45 to the gallon not big tax four wheel drive three litered lazy diesel um four seater convertible so you know i don't think you can pack much more into sort of 10 grand's worth of car but um onto this front wing on the driver's side that looks to be clean and tidy that 90 so it's 19 inch alloys on these guys and again that alloy's been sent away to be professionally refurbished and that tire looks to be recently new at about six, seven mil. Mirror house is clean and tidy. Driver's door, rear quarter, all as it should be. That alloy has been refurbished and is as new. That tire, like the others, recently new, 500 miles ago. Inside the car's nice guys, black leather. We've got a full complement of handbook. We've got two keys for the car. It's obviously sat nav, quattro auto four-wheel drive a little bit of course we've been training since 2001 so we're 20 years old now we're based in a little village called east Farley, just outside maidstone in kent and read our reviews at autotrader.co.uk guys we are well regarded we're nice people to buy used cars from we've been doing it a long time we're very fair and straightforward we've got 300 plus five star reviews uh, which have been a mass over a five to six year period and i think that goes to confirm our high levels of customer satisfaction over a long period of time but back to this lovely a5 three litre tdis line led rear lights there rear park sensing twin pipes and as i say i've owned a couple of these and this three litre tdi audi engine is a lovely power plant 45 to the gallon is more than achievable and silky smooth boot lids clean and tidy before you organize your money for this lovely uh, a5 cab speak to us we're partner finance with close brothers and if you're great credit risk they've got a super low interest rate for you so give us a shot at that guys and don't believe we buy any car we are the best buyer of used cars and we will always prioritise somebody over a cash buyer if they're financing with us and or part exchanging a good retailable bit of stock. So if you're a cash buyer at Oakwoods having sold your car to we buy any car, you will be at the bottom of the pile, guys, okay? Back to this alloy, that's been refurbished. That tyre is uh, recently new, probably seven mil. Rear quarters clean and tidy, no seal plate damage there. Front door, so the coach was the car is in good order, guys, yeah? See the back is nice. Got all the handbooks there and an iPod lead. Like I say, two keys, but generally in really, really good order. Heated seats, climate. This is what the car is, guys. It's a Quattro. First registered, March 2010. Obviously, plenty of owners, guys. They've been they're all popular, and this one's 11 years old, so. There is an outstanding uh, finance agreement, which is just about to lift. 
we are going to be new to MOT in the car, but this is all of the MOT records for the car, just to confirm all the mileage. This is a matter of public record via the .gov UK portal. And then we've got a service book here, guys, which has got, I think, in total about nine services. So it's what you call a full service history. But it'll be on the advert, guys, and you can review it if you decide to come down and look at the motor car. It's had a handbrake module fitted recently. There's a bill for £1,200 for that. And that was the last service that was carried out. And we're just going to new the MOT it. Okay, so there's some service invoices here. I think it's had a wheel bearing. It's had a major service there, which was a lot of money. Okay, and that was done. What was that? 88,000 miles. So it's just a, just an MOT this time around, guys. I start the car up. I've driven the car. Car drives beautifully. Uh, like I say, black power hood, which works as well as it should be. You can just see the aluminium trim strip there. A couple of little marks, but nothing major. Certainly, it doesn't look it's 11 years old now. A little bit of wear on that driver's seat. We're not going to get involved in that. It's there, nevertheless. There's your mileage today, guys. 90,000 miles. It's all revs free. Like I say, heated seats, navigation, all the power hood works. Let's just put that up for you. Looks like it's got an acoustic hood, guys, whatever that means. Just looking down now, that's all okay. Cruise control as well. So there we go, look, guys, I get there's a few A5 S lines for sale in the marketplace at any one time, and, and I also understand price is important, but I think equally as important is what you buy, and this is a particularly nice motor car with a great robust service history and great order and where you buy it from we're a well regarded long established independent dealer so if you're looking for a nice A5 3 litre TDI S line Quattro auto cab this weekend this is worthy of going into your shortlist it's a nice car thanks for watching